हेलो स्टूडेंट्स दिस इज प्रॉब्लम नंबर फाइव ऑफ चैप्टर इनकम एंड स्पेंडिंग सपोज कांग्रेस डिसाइड्स टू रिड्यूस ट्रांसफर पेमेंट्स सच एज वेलफेयर बट टू इंक्रीज गवर्नमेंट परचेजेस ऑफ गुड्स एंड सर्विसेज बाय एन इक्वल अमाउंट दैट इज इट अंडरटेक्स अ चेंज इन फिजिकल पॉलिसी सच दैट चेंज इन गवर्नमेंट एक्सपेंडिचर इज इक्वल टू माइनस ऑफ चेंज इन transfer payments why minus because the government reduces the transfer payments okay and both these changes reducing transfer payments and increasing government purchases they are of equal amount first part would you expect equilibrium income to rise or fall as a result of this change why check your answer with the following example suppose that initially these values have been given to us and now let that the change in government expenditure is 10 and change in transfer payments is minus 10 okay we have studied this equation in this chapter that equilibrium level of income is equal to the multiplier times the autonomous spending in the next step we can write it as change in equilibrium level of income is equal to multiplier times the change in autonomous spending this change in autonomous spending this change in autonomous spending is equal to this value which is autonomous consumption plus mpc times transfer payments plus investment expenditure plus government expenditure plus net exports increase in government purchases by change in gbar equal to 10 will increase the autonomous spending by c if this value is increased then definitely this value will also be increased right and because in our case change in gbar equal to 10 so the autonomous spending will also be increased by 10 clear and that is the reason we have written that increase in government purchases by change in g bar equal to 10 will increase the autonomous spending by change in a bar equal to change in g bar equal to 10 clear decrease in government transfers by change in tr bar equal to minus 10 will decrease the autonomous spending by c when this transfer payments is reduced the autonomous spending will also be reduced right and the autonomous spending will be reduced by c change in tr bar okay this small c represents mpc okay mpc times change in transfer payments so it is equal to mpc times transfer uh, uh, change in transfer payments is equal to minus 10 okay so decrease in government transfers will decrease the autonomous spending by this amount final change in autonomous spending will be change in g bar plus uh, i mean this value this value plus this value this will be the final change in autonomous spending 10 plus mpc times minus 10 so when you will solve this we'll get this one 1 minus mpc times 10 this is the final change in autonomous spending increase in equilibrium income will be change in equilibrium level of income equals to multiplier times the change in autonomous spending and in the next step because we have just calculated the value of change in autonomous spending so we will incorporate that value in this equation and the final answer will be that the increase in equilibrium level of income equals to 1 minus mpc upon this one times 10 so we have just incorporated the value of change in autonomous spending in this equation this is the final answer okay b part 
find the change in equilibrium level of income okay so we have just arrived at this equation in part one right and in the first part we have given these values that MPC is 0.8 and tax rate is 0.25 so we will use these values or we will incorporate the incorporate these values into the equation in the next step we will write change in equilibrium income equals to 1 minus 0.8 upon 1 minus 0.8 times 1 minus 0.25 10 and when you will solve this equation the final answer that you will get is that change in equilibrium level of income is 5 clear part c what is the change in the budget surplus why has budget surplus changed the budget surplus should increase since the level of equilibrium income has increased and therefore the level of tax revenues has increased while the change in government purchase and transfer payments cancel each other out numerically this can be shown as follows we know that budget surplus is equal to tax rate times the income which is the tax revenues minus the government purchases minus the transfer payments in the next step we can write it as change in budget surplus equal to tax rate times change in income minus change in government purchase minus change in transfer payments now we will just incorporate their values in the next step that is tax rate is 0.25 equilibrium income is 5 change in government purchase 10 change in transfer payments because transfer payments were reduced so its value was minus 10 in the next step this will become 1.25 this is minus 10 and this is minus minus plus 10 so as we have just seen that the government purchase and transfer payments these will be cancel each other out and the final answer will be change in budget surplus is 1.25 clear Thank you.